says, At the middle, he reached the capital city and he found guards. And what did the guard tell him? The guards tell him is to go home and look where? Under a stove. Under a stove for the treasure. Well, you can put, make Ooh. an arrow right there and go to the back. This one I wrote. In the middle, Isaac went to the capital city. Our captain told him to go where he came from and look under a stove. A man of a man. Of named a man Isaac. named Isaac. Just right of a. Okay, so my kids have all gone home. It is like 2.40 and I have not got to film. And I've picked up my camera a few times and filmed a couple of things we were doing today, but I have been so busy during lunch. I ate in the teacher's lounge during our planning today. I had PLC, so yeah. We had a very busy afternoon. We did math intervention groups this afternoon. And so we switch around and I get, you know, kids from other classes and we kind of do ability grouping. And so the group that I was working with needed help understanding which operation to do with the word problems. So I think I had about 17 kids in here. I gave them base 10 blocks and it was just not that successful. After the, fir the first problem they did okay with, they helped me. We came up with an equation for the word problem and then I had them solve it and then they shared their strategies and then it was like after that one they were just done and so it was a struggle just to keep their attention <sighs> unfortunately but I think it's just because it's in the afternoon we go outside and then we come in and we switch rooms and we do math for about 30 minutes and then we go home and it's just the last 30 minutes of the day they're ready, they're done, they're ready to go home, and it's just, I'm going to have to figure out another way to have them engaged for next week. So, my room is a mess. Look at this. There's cards out here, random things there. Look at this table. Yeah, pencils on the floor. Another one. This table's a wreck. There's our ornaments we made. They're so cute. I've got to glue this on my tree. And then here's my desk. It's a mess. So I'm going to clean up, make sure I have everything ready for tomorrow. We only have four days of school this week. So tomorrow is technically our Friday. So I will be working on plans for tomorrow. Friday is Veterans Day, so we're out of school to uh, celebrate all of our veterans. And if you are a veteran and you're watching, thank you so much for your service. I really appreciate that. And I know that um, Veterans Day is a very well-deserved holiday. So to all you veterans, thank you. But I'm going to go ahead and clean up, the, clean up my room, get some stuff laid out for tomorrow, work on my newsletter. I've got to get homework and things like that ready. So I will catch back up with you guys in a little while. So I'm in the car. I just left school. It's 3.46 and I straightened up everything. I planned for tomorrow, making sure that I have everything ready. I planned a little bit of math for next week and my morning meeting plans and my literacy block. So that is done. Um, I did not get the ornaments on my tree, which I did. I have to set an alarm on my phone to remind me to clock out. 
because we have to clock out. And we've never had to clock out till this year, so luckily I clocked out today. But, um, so I didn't get the ornaments on my tree, which, like I was saying, I didn't, I hadn't planned on doing that at school. So I'm taking the ornaments and the tree home with me to work on that. Um, also my pencil sharpener was acting really crazy today. So I'm taking that to see if my dad can look at it and figure out what's wrong with it. I have no idea. I just, whenever you stick a pencil in it, it makes a really weird sound. Kind of like it's hung up somehow. So I'm going to have him look at it. And then I have a conference tomorrow after school that I have all the paperwork ready for. I just need to fill out the parent-teacher conference form that I use. So, I have a lot to do tonight, plus I have a huge stack of papers to grade. So, I will be doing several things at home this evening. Um, and I'm leaving school early, not early, but I'm not staying here to do those things because I'm going over to my mom's house to um, take her some money that I owe her and a shirt that she ordered from school. So that is what I'm doing. Um, I'll show you guys what my tree looks like as soon as I get it all hot glued on because everything has to be hot glued on because it has to travel to hospice. So I'll show you what that looks like. I'm excited. I think it's going to be beautiful. I, I really think it's going to be pretty. So I will check back in with you guys this evening. Okay, so I am home. I went to my parents' house this evening and hung out with them for a little while. here is my tree. I have it sitting on my counter here and I have all the little Christmas trees that my kids made on it. Isn't it sweet? So now I'm going to put this star on the top. I bought this at Michael's last night. It was, let's see, $3.99. Woo! Drop it in the floor. So I bought this to use as the topper. So I'm gonna figure out a way to put that on the top of the tree there. And I think that is gonna be so super cute. But um, I've got my hot glue guns here ready to go. I've gotta hot glue it on since it has to travel to hospice. And um, you know, that way none of the ornaments will fall off. So I'm gonna work on that. But um, I'm going to go ahead and end this vlog. Thank you guys so much for watching. And if you're new to my channel, go ahead and subscribe so you can see more videos from me. I'm trying to get in a good routine of filming my day and uploading it. So I hope that you guys will continue to come back and check out my videos. Don't forget to click on the thumbs up like button down below if you did, if you liked it. And subscribe to my channel and I'll see you guys in my next video.